Yes now, bless now. Don't forget the rest now, Desmondo. Big D signing in, live and large. Badong. Badong. Yo. For all the punks and skins, we're listening to Rancid. I've never listened to this record. I've never even seen this artwork before. So that goes to show um, how much of a potential hidden gem this could be. We start from the start. We listen to the discography. We've got 16 tunes on this record. Uh, Epitaph Records has put it up, so I don't know if this is a remastered, but this is the self-titled. Okay. Um, I'll, man, back in the day, Operation Ivy was, for a stretch, my favourite band. Like, I, I just put Operation Ivy before all of the rest because I loved the lyrical content. I loved the energy. I loved the ska punk. I just loved the music. Rancid has been a bit hit or miss. Uh, I'm familiar with and Out Came the Wolves and their singles, uh, you know, a couple of singles from Indestructible and stuff. And for me, they either hit it or they have, you know, they're a bit shaky on some songs where I don't necessarily feel it too much. But I don't know how many songs I know on this record. Let's have a quick look at the song listing. I don't know any of these songs. I don't know any of these songs. So this is going to be a whole new listening experience. Um, I hope the sound quality is good. If Epitaph's put it out, I'm sure it'll be half decent. Uh, and without further ado, we're going to jump into it. So if you want to check out the link in the description, that's going to have all of the full album commentaries. Months and months and months and months and months and months prior to release. Support independent. I'm an artist myself in my own right. Let's get into it. This one's Edina. Come on. Production value is really good. And the thing is, right, regarding these ska punk bands, the bass line is always ridiculous. Guitar-wise, drum-wise, this is just a punk rock song. Three chords, if that. Driving drummer. But the bass line is just walking and walking and walking. So we haven't even got to any sort of ska element. But normal punk bands don't utilise the bass guitar like ska punk bands do. And I don't know why. I don't know why. Good production, by the way. Good production regarding a debut. the skinhead fella in the band at this point because that that lead vocal that we've had sounds completely different to what i'm used to who's the skinhead guy called he's in like the last resort and all sorts nowadays i think stomper summer and all that mm. matt freeman matt needs to sing more matt freeman I mean, before punk rockers, these lot of songwriters, they know how to put a good song together. That's why Rancid are 
still leading the wave as far as it goes now. Always been able to put a good song together. We've got Hyena coming up next, potentially a music video by the looks of things. Hi. Jeez Louise. <laughs>